I saw this and I've seen this before in like one of the commercials on the internet and it's supposed to be really good to help with wrinkles in your skin tone and I have so many wrinkles now lots of them and I also have bags under my eyes pretty bad which this is what bothers me most right here I have such bags and such wrinkles over here and then there's this really dark spot right here and that drives me nuts and whenever I put makeup on this it cakes up in that spot now of course I'm getting older and I'm gonna have wrinkles I realize that but I'm about to turn 53 not 83 so I would think I wouldn't have this many if I could just get rid of some of the bags and you know this stuff on the side that the makeup gets caked up in that would make me probably feel better I would love to have facelift that would that would you know that would make me happy but um I can't do a facelift that's just kind of out of the question so anyway I saw this stuff and I thought I would try it so I'm going to try it I found it at Sephora it was $42 and that was my big purchase of the day really because I never pay money for stuff like that but I'm going to try it and it says try it with your face freshly washed no makeup so we're I'm gonna do that okay so I wash my face Just trying to make sure it's dry good okay wait I can't read that okay so it says this is a primer that instantly tightens, firms, and blurs the look of skin, temporarily minimizing the appearance of fine lines and pores for flawless makeup application. And then it says, shake well for best results, sparingly apply a thin layer to freshly cleanse dry skin. Remain expressionless and the product will dry within three to seven minutes until your face feels pulled and tight. Okay, well, we're going to try it. It doesn't really say if you can put it on your eyelids, but I'm gonna put it on my eyelids. Okay, here it goes. I'll start up here. Okay, so I did speed it up a little bit during this part, but I tried not to speed it up too fast so that you could kind of see what was happening during this. I am using a very thin, I'm putting a very thin layer on there. I'm just using like a tiny dot each time. And I wasn't really sure if that was enough, but I didn't want to use too much. And it doesn't really say, it just says to apply a thin layer. So you're gonna see me talking during this part, but I muted it because I'm not really saying anything important. Also, this is not a sponsored video. This is just me giving my honest opinion of a product that I found myself. I can definitely feel it. I'm putting little tiny dots like this. I don't really know if that's too much or not enough. Another thing I wanted to say is that as soon as you put it on, you can feel it immediately start tightening your skin. And sometimes you'll see me kind of going back over a spot and you really shouldn't do that because if it dries and you go back over it, you're going to cause it to cake up. So you need to do each little section at a time and then don't go back to it. Just leave it alone. Okay, so I did speed this part up too and I muted it. Um, I'm just standing here trying to get it to dry and I did this for probably, I don't know, I guess about four minutes. And I left it so you could kind of watch as it's working, but I know I look really dumb just standing there fanning my face. 
and <laughs> the things we put on YouTube, it just blows my mind. My daughter walked in and saw me and walked back out of the bedroom in the background, and she's like, Mom, what in the world are you doing? <laughs> but I left it because I wanted y'all to be able to kind of see, so you could see if if you notice a difference or not. And if I talk during this time, I'm not saying anything important, so... I can definitely feel it pulling, tightening my skin. I, I, it still feels like it's not quite dry though. And it's been like four or five minutes. I can definitely feel the difference. I'm thinking maybe my eyes aren't quite as bad as they were. They have a special cream that's just for eyes, but I didn't buy it because it was kind of pricey. And I was too cheap. kind of make a difference. I mean, I can still see my places under my eyes, but if I use this under my makeup, well, this dark spot right here, well, I'm going to put on my base makeup and then I'm going to see if it helps any. We'll see. And also, I don't wear a lot of makeup ever. I don't know. I still see a lot of wrinkles. And I feel like whenever I wear makeup, I see more wrinkles than before I put the makeup on. Hmm. Maybe I just don't know how to put the makeup on right. That could be the problem. I don't know. Facelift. I need a facelift. That would help. Definitely. See, I still see a little caked up spot right there. I can feel it pulling though. I can tell that it, I can tell a tiny difference. Maybe not a big difference, but I can probably see a little difference. And they do have other products that go with it. They have a special cream for eyes and I might need to try that. So this is what I tried. This one. I don't know what I did with the box. Yeah. It's instant firm. Instant firm primer. See, now that I'm looking at it now, I, I can kind of tell a little bit of a difference. I don't know. What do you think? Can you tell a difference? Have you tried it? Am I doing it wrong? Maybe that's the problem. Maybe I'm just doing it wrong. Let me know. Let me know in the comments how you get rid of wrinkles. That would help me greatly. Other than a facelift. If you know something other than a facelift, let me know what you're using. I will say I think this one is the best product so far.